entrepreneurs quite often are, 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 are treated as a sort of, of a tribe of people, but of course the conditions for each of their businesses um, vary radically. I mean, some businesses are capital intensive, so you need a lot of investment in kit and plants and machinery. And some businesses, you need very little. Um, you know, you need a keyboard and, and away you go. And I think that, um, you know, those two extremes, if you like, sort of paint the picture of, of modern entrepreneurship. What I do think, though, is the thing that often holds people back is they think that they need more than they actually do. So I, I'm a good case in, in kind for that. In, in, in our business, um, we had, um, my business partner and I had basically um, put ourselves on bread and rations and um, we'd spent five years building a battle chest um, to actually um, to actually start our business. Um, in the event, um, what we found was we didn't need anything like we needed to to actually form that business and to form a very good business um, um, in terms of the actual capital outlay. And I think this is the big trend at the moment, which is that the reality of living in this century means that we're the first generation where actually the sort of the initial capital that you need to set up a business is, is less than it's ever been. So the barriers to entry, I think, is the first big um, factor that's changing entrepreneurship, which is that it's easier for people to actually have a go if they've got the temperament and the inspiration to do it. In terms of other sorts of trends that I think are interesting is that I think that um, the people that run entrepreneurial businesses um, are increasingly brands. Um, you know, a lot of entrepreneurs that you see, I mean, they're speakers, they're, they represent their own business, they become, if you like, the sort of a really important part of the IP of, of a business. And I think when you're running your own business is that that role is very important. You're the chief communicator. Um, you're the person that needs to get out there and sell it when you're pitching. And, and that be, that's a very important part of the job spec of a lot of entrepreneurs that you know may not have been the case in, in times past when we lived in an age that was less visual, less sort of communicative, um, if you will. And so your ability to actually get out there and sell your story is, is, is really important um, in terms of the modern entrepreneurial story. Of course, the, um, the, the flip side to that is that um, when it comes time to sell your business, if too much of that story is invested in you, it becomes very, very difficult to then actually sell your business because you're selling yourself. The final thing that I think is a really important theme in, in entrepreneurship is the issue of friendship. Mark McCormack was the inspiration behind Jerry Maguire, you know, show me the money. And um, what Mark McCormack said was that he said that all things being equal, people will buy from a friend. All things being unequal, people will still buy from a friend. So the biggest single thing you can do, I think, in business is invest in the business of friendship.